Still ahead at three, Sunday's MTV Media Video Music Awards will be unlike any other of the event's previous shows. Ahead, we take a look at what's to come and who is set to be on it. Well, due to the pandemic, this year's MTV Video Music Awards will be unlike any other. Rather than being held at a single venue with an audience, the show will feature outdoor performances across New York City. Entertainment and pop culture expert Jackie Jordan will be making an appearance at the VMA Sunday, and she joins us live with what we can expect. Hi, Jackie. How are you doing today? Yeah, thanks, Stephanie. Really looking forward to uh, the event that's unfolding Sunday night. I think the uh, MTV uh, Video Music Awards are certainly going to be uh, exciting this year, and it's going to be very different. We're not in the same performance territory that we used to be in. And we have had two new categories added this year uh, as a result of the changes that we've gone through here in 2020. One of the categories, of course, is the best music video from home and then as well as the best quarantine performance. And what is so fascinating about the MTV uh, Video Music Awards, which we'll probably find every year, is there's a little tad bit of controversy. And of course, this year isn't without that in the way that the quarantine requirements are not going to be held uh, for, the, uh, for the performers coming into New York City like they are for any other travelers. So there's a, you know, a little bit of a co controversy there for the two new categories that they um, and that they have added. However, MTV has also announced that this year's show is going to be in honor of the everyday heroes, the frontline medical workers. And there will also be performances by uh, a lot of celebrities who are gonna be uh, performing for the COVID-19 uh, first re responders. So activism is definitely going to be a very big part of it. Absolutely. The show is gonna be hosted by the young Kiki Palmer. Uh, daytime Emmy nominated 2020 talk show host. I think she's a really great fit for it. So, so Jackie, I have to ask, you know, um, who do you think are going to be some of the artists who are going to take home all of those prizes? Well, you know, it's, uh, you know, I think, I think it's a perfect tie in terms of nominations this year between Lady Gaga and Ariana Grande because they both have the uh, equal nominations and they also collaborated on a song that received multiple nominations, which is Rain On Me, um, including for one of the categories that I happen to like, which is best choreography, because it's a, a well choreographed uh, dance um, video between the, two, between the two performers. And having attended uh, events like the Teen Choice Awards, it's also really fun to see the up and coming artists come into it. And MTV has always historically had, since 1984, their push category. Billie Eilish has been uh, the recipient of that category. And in my day, it was Annie Lennox from the Arrhythmics. But I think this year it's going to be Doja Cat. I think she's going to be the uh, up and coming performer. Well, thank That's you so get. much for joining us, Jackie. I think I could ask you a million more questions about this, but I appreciate it. And I think we're all looking forward to Sundays, unlike any other VMAs. Thank you so much. It will be unlike any other. Thank you, Stephanie. Have a good one. Well, turning now to weather. You